hello welcome to today's video all right so in our previous video we looked at uh, question 1a and for today we'll be looking at question uh, uh, 1 uh, B all right so question 1 B uh, the answer will look like this this is the answer hopefully you're able to see let me put it nicely so that it can be seen this is the answer all right, so how did I do this? There are, there are four red pens and uh, five green pens. So you first add the number of pens in the box. So in the box, we have uh, nine pens. When we add four plus C five, it's nine. So thereafter, you can now make it a, 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 a tree diagram. This tree diagram, there is a point which says without the replacement. So when a pen is picked, you don't need to, there's no need of putting it back. So it will look like this. Here, there are nine pens. Is probability of picking red or green so what is the probability of picking red so you go to the total number of red which is nine which is four over the total number of pains in the in the in the box and then what is the probability of picking a, a green or so you write five over nine five is coming from this the total number of green uh, uh, green pens I mean green pens so again they said in the second time you pick there is a chance that you can pick red and uh, also green even here there is a chance that you can pick red or green so here since uh, if we go this way it means the red has already been picked so you, you write the probability of picking red the second time will be 3 over 8 this 3 over 8 it means 1 is out has been picked which is right so remain with 3 the total number of, of, of pains in the box were 9 so if we get 1 we remain with 8 how about green green the probability of picking green is uh, uh, 5 over 8 in the second round this is because in the first round red was picked this is red was picked and then second round we can pick green for the first time after picking red and then if green was picked there is a chance that we in the second time we can pick uh, red and this red will just be the total number of red which is four because in the first place in the first round red was not picked if green was picked in the first round the second round the probability oh sorry here it's eight the probability of picking green is uh, five over eight so we're done there next we can uh, we can do this i like doing this yeah okay all right uh, red red is uh, one over six then uh, okay red then green is five over 18 then green red is uh, five over 18 again green green is five over 18 so how am I getting these probabilities at the end here? I'm just multiplying this probability by this probability, meaning the probability of getting red, red. Like first time you get red, second time you get red. It's 1 over 6. You multiply their probabilities. And then here you multiply red and green. You multiply the probability of red and green. It's here. And then green and red, it's here. Green, green, you also multiply. It's over here. 
So that's what you do, such that when you add these numbers, these probability, they should give you, uh, they should give you one. So that's how it is. Okay, we can check question two. It says, um, what is the probability of picking one red pen and one green pen? So one red pen and one green pen, it's here. This is a red pen and a green pen. Green pen over here, red, red, green, I mean red, green, green, red. Here it's red, red, and down here it's green, green. So we get the probability which is over here. Here, we get a probability which is here, here. Because this is green, red, red, green. So it will be 5 over 80 plus 5 over 18 which will give us uh, 5 over 9 so this is the answer for 2 uh, b2 so this is b1 and uh, over here it's a uh, b2 thank you very much